On November 20, 2017, some seven months after my first and last breakup, the B-52 buffs and the F-22 Raptors targeted the Taliban drug labs in Afghanistan. The Taliban prohibited poppy cultivation when they governed the country in the late 1990s, but have since come to rely on it as they wage an increasingly potent insurgency against a wholly unjustified and brutal invasion of Afghanistan. The B-52 Stratofortress bombers with Afghan Air Force aircraft dropped 2,000-pound guided bombs, aka Guided Freedom, serving the nation since 1998, meanwhile they were supported by the F-22 Raptor stealth fighters during the raids. Poppy planting and production were thought to bring around $200 million a year to the Taliban. The strikes, or you can say freedom-delivering tasks, were essential as Afghanistan's opium production nearly doubled in 2017 as compared to 2016, while areas that are under poppy cultivation rose by 63 percent, based on a joint survey conducted by the UN and the Afghan government. It was the first time ever that the US used its freedom-delivering machines to target drug production facilities.